guys welcome back so if you are familiar with the series that I'm doing on my channel right now for Valentine's Day you know this is one of my Valentine's Day looks that I'm coming up with for you guys I decided I wanted to do five Valentine's Day looks using the same eyeshadow palette for all five looks I know it's crazy you guys I'm trying to challenge myself and this is look number three so if you've already watched my previous two videos I will go ahead and link them above you will definitely be able to find them above but if you've already watched my first two videos for look one and look two you know that this look is a little bit more aggressive <laughs> than those two looks just a little bit more aggressive but it's even though it's a little bit more difficult to achieve it's still easily attainable if you just follow the steps you know what I mean it's definitely something you can do so if you like something a little bit more aggressive <laughs> for Valentine's Day such as this eye look then you'll definitely see how to do it in this video now the eyeshadow palette that I am using for all five of my Valentine's Day looks is the BH Cosmetics L'Amour palette you guys should be very familiar with it by now and this palette is actually really surprising me. It's really showing me that, you know, it can definitely knock some looks out the park. So this is what this gorgeous pink kind of love red rosy palette has to offer you guys. So it's really pretty and I'm finding that it really performs nicely. I'm getting really familiar with the different shadows and kind of learning how to work them, how to play with them, which ones are nicely pigmented, which ones are not. So after I do look number five, I will kind of give you just my overall thoughts on this palette, just in case you're curious about buying it. It's really affordable. One of the palettes that BH Cosmetics often has on sale for very, very inexpensive pricing. So Anyway, enough of me jaw jacking as I say. Y'all know I get to talking and I just be running my mouth. But I'm really excited to show you guys this look today. Hopefully you like it. And if you'd like to see how I created it with this L'Amour palette, then stay tuned. Because it's coming up next.
Bye.